Hey everyone, thank you for watching. In today's video, I'm so excited to do, it is going to be all about the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. I'm gonna be going through the sale calendar, letting you know what I think is worth it, if there's anything that I'm planning to pick up for myself. I will have the link to the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty calendar down below, and let's go ahead and get started. All right, welcome. So I always start off my videos with an outfit of the day. Today, I just have on this pink dress here. Got it from Target a while ago. It's just kind of one of those casual dresses that I wear like around the house. I'm just trying to to help Will spring to stay in Las Vegas. We've had super nice days and then every once in a while like a very chilly, very windy day will happen. Like yesterday it was like 42 and super windy. I'm like, all right, maybe if I dress like spring, spring will actually stay here. Like we have 70 degree days, then we have 40 degree days. And I'm like, all right, Let's stay with the 70s. Like, that would be great. Like, I would love that. So that's what I'm wearing today. I did do a little bit of filming on this look. I just used the ColourPop in the Limelight collection once again. I used a Jelly Munch shadow uh, and then also the palette. I actually filmed it for my TikTok, which is by Samantha March. I'm sure I'll probably end up putting it on Instagram, which is March Beauty Word. Welcome to Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. <laughs> I am excited to do this video, even though if you saw... My last video, not my live chat that I did on Saturday, but the video that I posted on Friday was a shop with me at Ulta Beauty. That did not go so well. I'm actually filming this on Friday, so I've been watching all of the comments come in today, and some of them are, are quite funny because it was just a disastrous shopping trip, and like one thing after another kept going wrong. And, uh, but it was fine, but you know, you try to make the best out of it. And, you know, I just read one comment that was like, I could feel your frustration, but I was entertained. And I was like, you know what, good. That's, that's what I was here for. That's what I try to do. <laughs> I try to make people smile and keep you somewhat entertained, even through the bad times. So I said at the end of that video, I was like, I am excited to do the Alta 21 days of beauty still, even though, even though that experience wasn't great, but it's fine. But it's fine. If you're not familiar with the Alta 21 Days of Beauty, basically during this time, Alta has beauty sales every single day up to 50% off. It is only on that particular day that a specific item is discounted, but Alta gives you the full calendar ahead of time so you know what it is that you're shopping for on what day you're shopping for and so you don't miss any of these sales. Again, that will be linked in my description box. And as always, I link everything that I'm wearing, all the makeup I'm wearing, things like that. And those are affiliate links, so if you do any shopping through those links, I always thank you so much, uh, especially during times like the Alta 21 Days of Beauty sale, the upcoming Sephora sale, uh, that really is what helps support my channel. So. I appreciate that. I did also want to say sometimes the real popular items can tend to sell out. So if there's something that you really want, I would suggest either getting to the store early or ordering it online early if you want to get that one. But I'll go ahead and scoot over. I'm going to go through and I'll say that I actually, when I went to Ulta Beauty, I was going to do some filming there for, you know, reels and TikToks. And I was like, oh, I'll do a what I recommend versus what I don't recommend during the sale. And I was going through the calendar and I was like, I don't really see anything that I'm like, don't get that. No good. I, so I, I, I'm happy about that. I think that's great. And there was a lot of things that I saw that I was like, hey, that's pretty good. Typically, I think that Ulta Beauty, the 21 days, I feel like it's kind of hit or miss, but more of a miss for me personally. This one, just as I was glancing through it and trying to get like my content ideas, I was like, I think that this looks pretty good. So I'm curious to hear your thoughts and of course what you're picking up. But starting off on the first day, so we have Sunday, March 13th. There's 50% off the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Brow Wiz. Typically we see this in the sale, but brow products are a great thing to be able to stock up on at half off. Uh, I know for me, I personally love the benefit precisely my brow, which is in my brows today, or the Goof Proof. And brow pencils can get expensive. You can go through them quickly. So to get it 50% off, uh, I think that's pretty nice. Also, the original Beauty Blenders are going to be 50% off. I like It has a little sticker that says, first time steal. So these are $20, so they're pretty expensive for beauty blenders, especially nowadays that we have so many that are such great quality and for a fraction of the price. Like my personal favorites are like the DSMD shop sponge and that one is $6. So to get these for 10, I think that's a really good deal. Also, this one is gonna be online only, but 50% off the MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus. So originally $31 is gonna be on sale for $15.50. I'm actually gonna to plan to pick that one up uh, in my Shop With Me haul. I was just seeing if they had the Fix Plus that had like the moon on it. It's a new collection that they had. 
and uh, I ended up being able to find the Fix Plus in the store, but not the MAC mascara that I was going for, so I just kind of like gave up on that. But I had also seen that the Fix Plus was going to be included in the sale, so it was like, why would I not just wait for that? So I'll end up placing that order uh, on Sunday, the day that this video is going to go up. I'm going to place an order for the Fix Plus to get it 50% off. And then also another first time steal, this is from Tula. So they are having 50% off their Protect and Glow Daily Sunscreen Gel Broad Spectrum SPF 30. So that seems like a pretty good deal. You know, I'm all about sunscreen and sun protection. So if that is a favorite of yours or one that you've wanted to try, you can get it for 50% off. I have to say, starting off with a bag, I feel like we were starting off with a bang on that first day. Moving over to Monday, March 14th, we have another first time steal, 50% off the Smashbox of full size primers. I don't think I've seen these new ones. They have like the different packaging. I feel like I've tried Smashbox primers in the past, but I don't think any of these. But that is an option online only from Nude Sticks. We have select nudies. These are going to be 50% off. So these look to be like contour, uh, bronzer, and brush sticks. I feel like a lot of people really do like these. I wasn't into them when I first tried them, but that was also when I wasn't super into cream makeup. So I feel like maybe I should give them another try. I don't know. Would you want to see me test them out? Because I really do hear a lot of good things about them. Also on that day, we have 50% off the Peach and Lily Matcha Pudding Antioxidant Cream and also their Transparency Pro Spot Treatment. The Matcha Moisturizer is one of my favorites. I just used it today. Uh, I'm probably half probably half gone on the bottle that I have in my current routine and it's maybe like my third one now. Uh, I or I bought it the first time for myself and then I believe I've gotten them in PR from Peach and Lily since then but it's a product that I would repurchase uh, because I think that is fantastic. So those are the, the sales that I wanted to point out for that day but definitely a lot from Peach and Lily really does impress me but I definitely enjoy the matcha moisturizer. I could see that one kind of moving a little bit fast if that's one that you wanted to try. Moving over to Tuesday, March 15th, uh, Clinique has their high impact mascara for half off. Beauty Bakery has their lip whips for, these are all going to be half off, so I'm going to try not to be super repetitive there, but Beauty Bakery lip whips, neither of those are the mascara. I haven't tried them myself, but just kind of pointing out because they look interesting. Uh, another first time steal, this is from Cozarex, their Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence and their Advanced Snail 92 all in one cream. So those are both going to be half off. Uh, and I actually really do like the snail essence. I'm using it in my current skincare routine and I have been for a while. I have, oh, I almost threw my phone. I have like maybe that much left at the bottom. Like it's about to be empty. You'll see it in an upcoming uh, empties video from me. But I really do like that one. There's a lot of benefits to snail skincare, if you will. Uh, and I've heard a lot of people recommend that one. I think it was Jessica Braun that finally got me to purchase that one. So I bought it myself, but I'm pretty sure I bought it from Ulta Beauty. Uh, and yeah, I think that is really nice. So that is one to check out on Tuesday, March 15th. And then moving over to the 16th, uh, from Elemis, their Pro Collagen Marine Cream is gonna be included in the sale. And I like a lot from Elemis Skincare. I'm using their, um, one of their cleansing balms uh, pretty regularly in my routine. And also their, I think it's their like marine cleanser. I use that one pretty consistently also, but they are, a pretty pricey skincare brand so if there's something that you've wanted to try from them and i really do like their pro collagen line uh, this could be a good time to be able to pick up something at 50 percent off moving over to thursday march 17th st patty's day march actual march madness kickoff the basketball version not my version if you haven't seen march makeup madness has kicked off on my channel so it started with a live chat this is a game that i play every single year where i have different categories of makeup and there's four products in each category and you first have to fill out what product you think is going to be the most voted on throughout the whole game you submit your brackets it's just a google form and then each week i like so next week i will have it where the voting opens and so you'll vote for your favorite products then they go to a top two then you vote again then I do a full face of the most voted on products and we see whose bracket is the closest and you win a prize. So just a fun game. I'm doing it as a live chat for this uh, this time around. So make sure you check yesterday's video if you haven't seen that one yet. Uh, but on Thursday, March 17th, we have some more first time steals. From Tarte, we have their Maracuja Juicy Lip Balm and from KVD Beauty, uh, their Tattoo Liner. So I have tried the Tattoo Liner. 
I remember thinking like it was fine. I think mine dried out pretty quickly though. And I just have other liquid liners that I enjoy more. I just recently reviewed the Natasha Denona Macro Blade. I think that's a good one. Ofra and Sigma both have really nice liquid liners that I enjoy. I haven't tried that one from Tarte, but it sounds nice. Like it sounds like something I, I am enjoying right now, but I don't know if I'll pick that one up. I don't know if it's something that I like absolutely have to have. Uh, and then also online only on that day, we have from DHC their deep cleansing oil. I do like that one. I have used it. I think I've used like two different bottles in the past, but I know it's a pretty loved on cleanser. So it's, you know, always nice to get it for half off. And then on Friday, March 18th, we have from It Cosmetics, their Confidence in a Cream Anti-Aging Moisturizer. I really do like this one. I believe I've been through two and also a mini. Uh, I believe I purchased, I either purchased it the first time myself or I repurchased it myself. I know one of them I bought, one of them I did get sent to me from It Cosmetics, but again, it's a $50 moisturizer, so to get it for half off, I think is a pretty good steal. Uh, there's also a surprise beauty steal on this day. We'll just have to see what that is. Uh, from Dermalogica, they are having uh, a first time steal. They're, I just love seeing that little sticker now. Their Power Bright Dark Spot Serum. So this is a $95 serum. So once again, to get a 50% off, like that's pretty decent. I haven't tried this one. I do like a lot of skincare from Dermalogica. I haven't personally tried this one though, but that seems pretty nice to have that at 50% off. There is also an app exclusive that's gonna be half off select skincare tools. So just in here, I see uh, the new face, which is really nice. I've actually been using the new face every single day for the past week, I wanna say. I purchased it whenever Risa and I went to California and shopped the Nordstrom sale. It was months and months ago, but I was trying to wait and I have my acne clear up a little bit before I started to put this tool all over my skin and potentially be like spreading bacteria around. So I just started using my new face, but I also see like a jade roller. I use that every single morning. It looks like a gua sha is included in there. I use that quite frequently in my night routine. So that's nice if there's been anything that you've been thinking about grabbing. And then also on that day, online exclusive half off uh, some women found it brands. So I see like Oma Beauty in here, that's Sarah Hap, Mented Cosmetic, Keys Soul, Soul Care. Uh, so I think that's nice to see as well. Moving along on Saturday the 19th, we have a surprise steal. I wonder what these are gonna be like. From Clinique, we have some moisturizers. Haven't tried those personally myself. There's a fragrance from Lancome included. Those are, you know, typically pretty pricey. So it looks like it will come in a variety of different sizes that you can choose from. Uh, also, there's going to be half off Ofra highlighters. I believe that this was also in the last Alta 21 Days of Beauty, and I had quite a few people ask me if my Start Inspired, Start Inspired highlighter was going to be included, and it was. So stay tuned because I think it's just going to be all of the highlighters that are available on Alta are going to be half off. So that's a great steal. And if you want a recommendation, I would recommend Start Inspired. I think it actually, didn't it sell out? I think it sold out at the last Alta 21 days and it sold out like early because I remember, yeah, because people were texting me like fairly early, like I missed it. So that will be one. If you want to grab it, I would say get that one early. I remember being like so Moving on to the following week, we have a Sunday, March 20th, we have the Buxom Full-On Plumping Lip Cream, the Tarte Shape Tape Concealers, typically do see these on sale. Uh, for the Tarte, these are Diamond and Platinum exclusive, which I think it was this way last time too, and I, I don't really understand why, but like, okay. But those are some, you know, a lot of people really do like the, the Buxom. I've had a lot of friends in real life, in real life, if that's how you say it, that just continue to love the Buxom. I feel like it's one of those that maybe here in the online beauty community, it's like, okay, you know, yeah, but there's some other ones, but people who are maybe not like in this community and trying so much and learning all these new brands, they still seem to love their Buxom lip products, which is great because they're, you know, they are really nice. So I will say from Urban Decay, they have their brow blade on here. And that is one product that I, I didn't really enjoy. I felt like mine, cause on one side that has more of like a marker to it and mine dried out super quickly. I had gotten these in PR, so I had several different shades and you know, several shades that worked fine enough for me and they all did the same thing. So that's not really one that I would recommend myself. I'd probably say stay away from those unless it's like your fave, you know, <laughs> then get it half off. Uh, Nabla eyeshadow palettes are gonna be included. I think that's a pretty cool steal. Nabla does have some nice uh, eyeshadow palettes. I've tried a few for myself. I like them. I've never like completely lost my mind, but like the side to side palette I thought was a good one. I've tried some of their smaller ones too, and I thought that they were pretty decent. So if it's a brand that you've been interested to try out, would be nice to get it at the half off. Move to Tuesday, March 22nd. We have, oh, 
I think was this a day that didn't really not much jumped out at me there's gonna be 50% off for the first time from first aid beauty their coconut water cream I haven't tried that one myself I do like a lot from first aid beauty I haven't tried that one yet and then also online only 50% off to their get toned pro glycolic pro glycolic 10% resurfacing toner that's a $42 product then we move on to Wednesday March 23rd it's my birthday that's my birthday if you want to put it in your calendar, it's fine. You know, it's like no big deal. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But on my birthday, the 23rd, 323, we have 50% uh, off of Jaclyn Cosmetics, their pout, pout Spoken Liquid Lipsticks. So, you know, kind of a newer product from Jaclyn Cosmetics if you'd want to test it out. I haven't tried it myself. Uh, I think that's kind of all I see. My birthday is kind of like not a very exciting day. Well... Okay, it's a bit of a bummer. 50% so off multi-brand select wellness items. Like I see the Kopari, uh, their deodorant. I do like that. The uh, Posh Petty, I think it's called from Pageology. It's like the foot peel. I usually do that like every year. All right. Well, good thing there's other exciting things happening on that day. Like my friend's getting me an ice cream cake. I mean, I don't know if they're getting me an ice cream cake, but I'm just like putting it out in the universe that they'll get me an ice cream cake. Or I'll just go get my own ice cream cake. I'm an independent woman. Thursday, March 24th, we have from Urban Decay their all-nighter loose setting powder. I don't think I tried this one. I think I just tried their press powder and I really didn't enjoy it. So haven't tried the loose one myself. From Murad, we have their uh, their SPF 45, the oil and pore control mattifier. I believe I have tried this one. I do like quite a bit from Murad. They're usually kind of more pricey. Like, yeah, this one is $45. So little bit more pricey so it'd be nice to get it half off if you're looking for another good SPF. Friday the 25th, another surprise beauty steal. We have 50% off Lancome, their LaBase Pro Oil Free Longwear Makeup Primer. Also from Clarence, they have their double serum included. Not super familiar with either of those. Uh, half off the PMD, these are like the microderm. Those can be pretty pricey since they are the tools. So that's nice to get them half off. And then also the app exclusive, uh, there's going to be select palettes from multiple brands. So like I see La Rock on here. Uh, let's or who else is this? Maybe Too Faced? I can't quite tell who's all in that picture. But uh, select palettes, that's nice. That's nice to see. Saturday, March 26th, we have the It Cosmetics CC Cream. It says that's a first time steal, which I'm kind of surprised to see. I'm surprised it hasn't been included in past sales. I know a lot of people really love that one. I personally was not the biggest fan. I haven't tried it in quite some time though, but it wasn't super for me. Okay, this says first time steal. The It Brushes for Ulta, their airbrush foundation brushes. They must just mean like those particular brushes, like the airbrush foundation brushes, because It Brushes for Ulta are always included in the sale. Am I? Right? I'm right, right? Am I right? I'm pretty sure I'm right. <laughs> There's a surprise beauty steal, and also The Ordinary has their squalene cleanser included, and that is a first time sale. I, I don't know if I've seen, has The Ordinary typically been included in the sales? I don't know that off the top of my head. I don't use a lot from Ordinary myself. And then moving into, this is gonna be the final week. So we have Sunday, March 27th, which is Aries half birthday, in case anyone is wondering. 50% off the Stila, their sale day waterproof liquid eyeliners. These are typically always included. Bare Minerals, their loose powder. Oh, loose and pressed powder. Haven't tried those myself. Uh, from Buxom, their full on plumping lip polish. And from Kopari, their exfoliating crush scrub. Kopari does have some really nice body products. I use quite a bit myself. So if that's a product you'd be looking for, that could be a good one. And then it says on Monday, March 28th, my little brother's birthday. We got a lot going on in the month of March, okay? There is multiple surprise beauty steals for diamond and platinum platinum members that are gonna be online only. I'm very curious. This is the only day that we have three surprise steals that will be shown to us. Tuesday, March 29th is interesting because there's 50% off the Urban Decay Hydromaniac Glowy Tinted Hydrator Foundation. This was one that actually really excited me. I love this product. I have recommended it so much. Uh, I believe I purchased this one myself from Sephora, I want to say it was, around the time that it first came out because it was something that really called me. I was like, I think that I would really enjoy this one and I've continued to recommend it since. I have talked to like a lot of people here at my comp complex have bought it off my recommendation and they all seem to love it. And we have like dry skin types, normal, combo, oily. It seems like a lot of people seem to enjoy it. So that's an idea, it's regularly $29, so we'll be on sale for 
Also, Smashbox is going to have their Be Legendary Lime and Prime line. I think thought I said lime. Line and Prime Pencil and Prime and Plush Lipstick. I haven't tried those myself, but I like trying lip products. I don't think it would be anything that I'd have to grab. Uh, Wednesday, March 30th, we have from Pure 50% off their 4-in-1 Pressed Mineral uh, Powder Foundation. I used to love this. This was like my original pressed powder that I loved before, <laughs> before Dior powder, no powder, but this was back in like college days, like early YouTube days. I just loved that one so much. Thursday, March 31st from MAC, this is a first time steal, their Studio Radiance Face and Body Radiant Sheer Foundation. I've never tried that one. Has anyone tried that one? Kylie Cosmetics is gonna have her matte liquid lipsticks included. There's gonna be half off select acne treatments from Zit Sticka, so like the acne patches. I like a lot of those. Oh, also, uh, this is gonna be online only, but the Murad AHA PHA Exfoliating Cleanser. I actually really liked this one. It's $42. Again, Murad is a little bit more pricey, but I tend to like a lot of their skincare products. So that's an interesting one. Friday, April 1st, April Fool's Day, we have from Benefit, their Gimme Brow is gonna be included. Not my favorite. I actually don't mind the one from Persona. They're kind of like brow gel product, kind of similar to this, but it's not something that I use a whole lot myself. Also from Benefit, it's going to be their Professional Setting Spray. I actually really like this one. I would recommend this at half off too. It's regularly $32, so it's going to be on sale for $16. It's going to be online only, but I definitely would recommend that one. There's a Surprise Beauty Steal and then an app exclusive that includes Conscious Beauty Select Skincare. So I see Kinship, Volition, Lolly, Indie Lee. So that is going to be an app exclusive on the first. And then the last day is going to be Saturday, April 2nd. We have a surprise beauty steal. The Tarte Man Eater Mascara. I didn't really love that one myself. Some uh, Lancome Select Skincare will be half off. And there's a, from San Tropez, their Self Tan Purity Bronzing Water Face Mist. I would maybe try that. It sounds like a face mist, I feel like isn't as daunting as like trying to rub something on my face because I typically avoid all tanning products on my face. It just, that just like freaks me out. But I don't know, it sounds kind of interesting. It's regularly $30. Has anyone tried that one? <laughs> it's just always looks so funny, especially as the weather will get warmer here. Like my body gets so tan that my face is just, it just gets a little bit harder to shade match <laughs> during those times. And then also online only, we have from Flawless by Finishing Touch, their beauty fridge. $60 on sale for third. After that, that is going to wrap it up for my thoughts on the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty, uh, what I'm interested in picking up myself, what I would recommend, just a couple items that I, I would say maybe skip over the sale if you were thinking about getting them. But overall, I feel pretty positive about the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty event. I think that there's some really interesting items that are included and I'm gonna plan to grab just a couple of things for myself uh, that I wanna pick up at the half off. So again, the calendar will be linked in my description box. I would love to know, is there anything that you are grabbing during the sale? But other than that, that is it. If you enjoyed this one, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. I hope you also consider subscribing before you go and I'll see you in my next video.